This might be the cutest unboxing I've ever done. Dior Sauvage Eau de Toilette. A little backstory on this one. Um, I was shopping at Nordstrom the other day for some skincare and uh, my, uh, can I say this? Uh, Personal skincare stylist, not no, well, not stylist, but the uh, the uh, the guy who was helping me out gave me this sample. So uh, Oliver, if you're watching this, I appreciate you, man. Thank you. Um, so yeah, I have the Eau de Parfum, Dior Sauvage. I bought that. That was my first nice designer fragrance that I got myself was Dior Sauvage Eau de Parfum. I was like, okay. So here's the Eau de Toilette. I've heard, uh, heard lots of good things about it. I mean, everyone knows about this one, so no surprise. It's not going to be a long one. I just wanted to give you my thoughts and, and unbox this, this fragrance, which is absolutely, you know, super cute. Small box. The cool thing is that it comes in the exact same box as, like, the bigger size, so I'm sure the presentation is going to be the same, but uh, enough jibber-jabber. Let's get to it. So, yeah. That's very nice packaging still. It's all the same as the bigger bottle. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> it is tiny. Uh, I wonder what this is. What is this? Is this 8 ml? 10 ml? Can't be more than 10. 5? I mean, look at this thing. Gorgeous. Okay, so it's a, it's not a magnetic cap. I was wondering, is it going to be the same type of cap as, as the larger bottle? But uh, this is actually a screw cap. That you, oh, no way. Okay. Is this a... Oh! Okay, you de... Oh, that's nice. Okay, so it's like a... You dab it on. It's not an atomizer. But, uh... Yeah. I love this bottle, honestly, it's so sleek, and the, the smoked glass that gets progressively darker uh, the higher up you go, it's uh, it's really nice. Yeah, gorgeous. Okay, I'll let you know what it smells like. This fragrance has been talked about in abundance, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna harp on it too much. It's um it's super versatile, it's super likable, it's also not very unique. A lot of people are wearing this. Um, it's, it's very predictable, it's very safe, so it might not get you, you know, um, creativity or uniqueness, but it's very likable. I think it's something that, again, super easy to pull off. Anywhere, office, clean, date night, signature scent every day, all seasons, all occasions. It's a no-brainer. It's a dumb reach. It's that's what it is, right? Like it's it's super easy. It's not something that you have to think too much about. It's like, oh yeah, today I can wear it to your survive. I can wear it to the gym. I can wear it anywhere. So, um, <clears throat> do I enjoy the fragrance? Yeah, sure, I do. I do. I don't like the fact that it's so common, so popular that it's it's a low effort kind of fragrance. But I can't I can't bash it for what it is, and what it is 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 something that's incredibly versatile and timeless as well. I'll just uh, apply it here and again, super interesting. It's like a... Oh, shoot. Okay. Well, I just soaked my hand. <laughs> super bright, super fresh. Bergamot, pepper. In the mid, you've got more pepper, but pink pepper. Interesting. Pink pepper. I didn't even know that was the thing. You can tell right away from the top, I get the lavender as well. So patchouli, lavender, and lots of pepper. Pepper in the top, pepper in the mid. Yeah, it's, it's great. Fresh, floral, bright, spicy, spicy floral. And in the base you've got ambroxan, cedar, labdomen. Again, it's a fantastic formula. It works. It's just boring. Could I say just because it's 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 so used and abused? Um, do I recommend it to someone who just wants one fragrance, starting out, wants something that is 
timeless that they can use now, they can use in five years. Uh, they just want one nice designer fragrance. Yeah, of course, of course. I think maybe the Eau de Parfum is a little more interesting, but Eau de Toilette, you can't go wrong. It's got fantastic performance as well. From what I've heard, it's, it's an all day scent, eight hours plus. Great projection. Pull this off at the club. It's, it's pumping off two feet easily. But uh, I really enjoy it. I think it's great. I just wouldn't be a fragrance that I would feel. It, it, when I wear the Eau de Parfum, it's not something that, that makes me excited to wear fragrances. I wear it because I enjoy the scent. I wear it because I know, hey, you know, it's an easy compliment getter. But it's not something like, oh yeah, today I'm going to plan to wear this outfit in this occasion, this scenario, and this fragrance. It's, it's, it's a dumb reach. So less thought often means less excitement in my mind. But yeah, that's all I have to say. Eau de Toilette, Dior Sauvage. You know it, it works. That's all it is. Um, thank you again, Oliver. Really appreciate it, man. Um, and uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers.